Welcome back to some Akuma Skylock. I kind of showed it a little bit. I'm sorry. I spoiled the secret, guys. I updated my island a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean I made some pretty good changes. So first off, we extended the farm all the way to meet the borders of our island, and I'm going to add more eventually. We also got our grinding area here, so I set this up in a perfect way. Basically, every single thing here will fall into the lava over on this side, which is absolutely beautiful, and it'll get sucked up into this chest here. On top of that, uh, my Enderman will spawn in, drop down in front of this guy, and then die. And then up here, I've got blazes that drop down right on top of me in case I want to go ahead and grind them, which is perfect. It is the perfect area. I'm going to go ahead and start off by chopping up my beautiful farm and get uh, a little closer to potatoes. But I don't think I'm going to get to potatoes. And that's right, we are going to the forest. Which means I need to actually get my axe. Let's see. So on the axe, it is 55 levels. I don't care enough, if I'm being honest, so I'm just gonna put that up for now, and we're gonna go to the forest. Oh wait, that's right, I don't have to go here, I can go to the other area. I forgot, because I already came here early. But I guess I can show you guys what this update, or this area does have to offer. Of course, we've got the lumberjack, you can sell wood to him, and you can see, um... Oh, it's got a wood cutting booster, let's go! There's also the soul well, you deposit souls, you get shit for it. I never get souls. It sucks. We've got quests, but I think I've accomplished, um, I guess some of these, not most of these. Oh, never mind. I just have two more breaking ones and then five souls, which will never happen. Okay, do I want you chopping with me? Uh, for 25,000 gems? Fuck no, I don't. So we're gonna chop, like, it's like a hundred, I think? Trees? It's a lot of trees that I gotta chop up. I don't think that counts. I remember before, it used to break trees so much faster. I think that they basically added more efficiency so that they could spread it out more. I, th I think that's the reason being. It makes sense, because efficiency 5 was all you really needed before, but now I think you need max efficiency to, to make it perfect. But it still chops up very fast. So I want to see how many quests I can get done. I don't, I don't know what's coming up, actually, I just realized. This one I already have done. Get your spawner limit perk to level 3. I'll have to check that in a minute. Uh, 5,000 grinding actions. That's the one. That's the one that stops me, unless we automatically complete it. Um, so I'm not even gonna humor looking ahead, because I don't think it will. Yeah, so I'll basically fly through- Is this- Wait, 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 wait. Pause. First of all, I, did, I finally got a soul. Thank god. Um, second of all, pretty certain this is about to be the only quest we do. I'm already past level 5, so as soon as I- As soon as I beat this quest, this one- this one, and maybe this one, are gonna finish automatically. I accidentally picked out what's coming, and I want to die. It's not a joke, I think out of all the time in my in the logging world for me, I've only ever gotten two souls. And I imagine that they must be really good if I've only gotten two. Yay, quest completed, guys! Oh man, that was so difficult. I might need a break after that one. Oh yeah, wait, hold on, I remember what this is about. There's rewards you get from it. It's like, a, it's like an openable. What do I get? Please give me something good. Don't give me something depressing. Well, the soul well is really cool. It's a neat feature. I wish I got better luck with my souls, but I don't. Did our other quests complete yet? Oh, they both did. That's good. That makes sense. Oh, all three of them did. That means that I did only do one quest, and I absolutely have to add on to my farm. I got everything I need. I want to build essentially this over here. Um, so I need to make sure first of all that fast place is turned off. Yeah, I love the fast place. It's a, it's sometimes a little fucking finicky though. I don't know why, but sometimes it just doesn't work the way you want it to. This has been a lot of dirt. Like I brought a few stacks and then I just bought uh four stacks. I think I ended up buying ah shit. Oh man, honestly, tilling the uh, tilling dirt, my least favorite thing to do on the server. Surely, oh, I'm near the end. I was gonna say, surely I'm near the end by now. I've been going for so long and finish. So over uh, the week, I should be able to get this all done, and hopefully by the next uh, video, I will have that challenge done. We just completely skip potatoes, huh? I mean, I'm still on fucking wheat now. I'm gonna give- I wanna give a, com a quick complaint here. You have these quests, but the thing is, I- I like that you can complete them automatically, but I also don't. 10,000 
uh, farming actions, which is enough to get you, this is the wrong menu, enough to get you to potatoes. So then I have to basically do another 10,000 to get to carrots, and then I have to start farming up carrots. That kind of sucks. Oh yeah, normally I open the pet eggs, don't I? Let's go and actually open all of these. I completely forgot about that, in case I get anything good. Although I guess that doesn't matter, seeing as I'm not taking any more pets, any new ones. You know what else I could also do? I just realized I could buy some witch spawners, which I think I might end up doing that because uh, I'm not really making a lot of money. I need to start putting into spawners. So you know what, actually, sorry, real fast. Let's actually just go back to the island and, and buy some spawners since I just remembered that I should do that. I also have 61,000 gems. Should I, should I upgrade you? So I don't really have a particular goal for the wood cutting. I just, uh, you know, I, you know, I, I don't know. I need to fill in the content. You know what, guys? Yeah, I gotta get that skill grind going on. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Guys, I'm an idiot. This is actually doing pretty decent for gems, and apparently for books, that's awesome. I also just thought of something. I should actually just go ahead and buy the spruce satchel. So now the spruce will go into that, and I don't have to worry about it being in my inventory, which is absolutely fantastic. So hypothetically, if I do a shit ton of grinding at the start of a season, could I just fly through the quests? Like, if I already have carrots unlocked, I already did my, my farming actions, my grinding actions, I already have my logging up, like, if I just do all that shit in my free time, is that just gonna make progression insane? Try to, like, basically just complete all of my quests. Maybe not all the quests, obviously, but, like, up until, like, where I'm at now, roughly, just completely fly through them. I love these enchanted trees, man. They give you so much wood. Hey, guys, don't mind me. Just gonna throw this in here. And, and deposit it, and then I'm gonna go ahead and spend this one. It's gonna give me a good reward. Watch, ready? Shit. So for some reason, my ping is like 300 on the server, so instead of going back and doing any more grinding or anything, I'm just gonna go ahead and open some things. Um, we got ourselves a holy pet egg. Let me go ahead and open that and see what I get. And get ready to salvage, because I imagine it's gonna be bad. Ultimate hair drops, go! Give me something good, please. Oh, a custom tag. That's actually pretty cool. Well, the last thing I technically have to open is this, but I also do have... I'm gonna open up my Tempest keys as well. Okay, maybe not. But I will open the things that I did get from it, such as these pet eggs, these holy pet eggs, and uh, these keys. Well, I'm gonna redeem the keys. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna open the keys. That would, that would just suck. Nothing good from that, of course. So, let's go ahead and redeem our XP pouches, our gem pouch, our value tickets, which I'm just not... I'm not really worried about selling them anymore at the moment. We got four villager spawners from that, and one iron golem, which goes there. Beautiful. That's gonna be even more money. And how much do we have right now? 133,000, just chilling in there. All right, time for our first V kit cluster. What do I get from you? A three robot builders? Oh, <gasps> we might get a fishing robot. And our last V kit cluster. Go. What will you give me this time? More spawners is always good, some money, and oh my god, that was 40. That was 40 iron golem spawners. <gasps> I have 100 iron golems now. That's pretty damn good. We also got an epic airdrop. Let me place that down real fast and see what it gives me. A lot, a lot, a lot of keys. Keys, keys are always good. I, I, I like keys. That's the wrong PV. Okay, the last thing I have to open are these three robot builders. Dude, these things are so cool. They, like, fight to the death. Well, I, okay, I, I mean... That freaking sucks. Can I get, like, a grinding robot or a fishing robot now? Okay. Can I get a fishing robot? No. Wait. No. I really did just get three fucking mining robots, huh? Make sure you join the server. All the information is down in the description. Uh, leave a like on this video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one.